Hey everyone, I'm Milan Klöver, a PhD student in Oxford, and I've participated this year in the East NWF Summer of Weather Code Challenge, and uh, my project was on data compression. Enormous amounts of data are produced at weather and climate forecast centers worldwide. Data compression is inevitable to reduce storage and to facilitate data sharing. Current techniques, though in addition to the real information, also a lot of bits that do not contain any information. In this project, the real information in the Copernicus Atmospheric Monitoring Service, which you can see here in the background, is analyzed. Most variables only contain a few bits of information per value, which are also highly compressible due to spatial correlation. The entire data set is compressed by a factor of 50, providing evidence that climate data archives have a large potential for compression without losing valuable information. I really enjoyed working on this Summer of Weather Code project um, and I got a lot out of it. So in the end, we have now an open source package that can be used by anyone to analyze the real information content in their data sets so that they can inform the data compression algorithm. Um, we have now prepared a manuscript that is uh, hopefully going to be ready for submission soon. Um, I've personally learned a lot about uh, information theory and data compression. And I'm really happy to see that, uh, that the results show that there is a big potential that is currently not exploited, uh, which will definitely be inevitable for the future when, for example, a center like ESNWF produces many petabytes of data every single day.